I had made my mind up that I was going to be a drummer when I was 13. I had every intention of, of going to London and total pipe dream. I had no right to think that I could do it, but I did. And I went to London with uh, a Rogers drum kit wrapped up in a blanket and literally and, then, and arrived at my sister's flat in London and someone heard me playing in the garage and said, would you like to play a gig? I'd never played a gig with anybody in my whole life. And that's how it started, a, literally a knock on the door. I started wanting to play drums when I was about seven years old. I don't really know why, probably because I couldn't do anything else. I was terrible at school. So I started banging around listening to music and literally started hitting leather pieces of furniture and tins and the usual story. And I loved it. The first drum kit was really a toy, almost a toy kit. It was called a gigster. And it was gold and there was one tiny little tom-tom and a cymbal that big and a snare drum and a bass drum. That was it. I didn't have a seat for it, so I always used to sit on the side of the sofa, making a nuisance of myself in the living room. I was blessed with being with really high-caliber players, Peter Green, John McVie. They came from the school, so I learned to do the right thing very quickly, and the right thing is to listen. And then I just started uh, really loving Tom Tom, signatures and stuff but uh, I changed things up a bit and really enjoyed getting into selections of cymbals. I started using a lot of mallets in the early days with Peter Green uh, in the first incarnation of Fleetwood Mac. Uh, songs like Albatross which was our first instrumental number one hit. It's all just really delicate tom-tom mallet stuff with cymbals so I've always uh, liked sweetening stuff in recordings, you'll, you'll hear a lot of funny, uh, hopefully fairly intelligent playing of, of overdubs of cymbals and cymbal swells and stuff like that. But basically, I'm a blues drummer, a blues drummer that's uh, made a journey.